My name is Sandy Karnowski. I'm the Public Affairs Manager for Cleveland Cliffs, and I would like to thank you all for being here today to cut the ribbon uh, to mark the completion of North Shore's DR Grade Pellet Project. And today we are celebrating another monumental moment in the history of iron ore mining. Cleveland Cliffs has completed its expansion of North Shore mining, making it the only U.S.-based iron ore processing facility to produce low silica DR Grade pellets. I couldn't be more proud uh, to be up here and, and talking about uh, these new, this new DR pellet and the people that are not only mining the iron ore, but built the facility. The expansion, the economic drivers uh, that are critical, not only for Northeastern Minnesota, but the safety and security of our nation. Not just for us, but for our national security, for our entire national Great Lakes economy, which by the way, if it were a nation, it would be the fourth largest economy in the world. And it's fueled by mining here in Minnesota. The North Shore Expansion Project is one of the most impressive undertakings and we've ever seen of this nature, and we should all be proud of it right here. In addition to the 150 full-time construction jobs during the course of work, this expansion will ensure economic opportunity for families of the employees now and well into the future. Our final speaker is credited with lead, leading Cleveland Cliffs to this monumental point in the company's 172 year history. He is highly respected as a leader in the iron and steel industry and as a friend of the people who work at Cleveland Cliffs operations. Please join me in welcoming the president, chairman, and CEO of Cleveland Cliffs, Mr. Lorenzo Gonsalves. After the Second World War, when we no longer had direct war here in Minnesota, Cleveland Cliffs introduced pelletizing as a way to utilize taconite and to keep a good thing going. And we are, we are going as of today. We're still going. And it will go for a long time. But the industry evolved. And now it's not just blast furnaces and not just blast furnace grade pellets to feed blast furnaces. We have 68% of the steel production in this country through electric arc furnaces. And the electric arc furnaces do not use our pellets. If you don't do anything about it, I would be okay because we, we are good for the next 10, 20, 25 years. But our kids, your kids, your grandkids would not be okay. Or at least they would not be able to be here because this industry would be gone. These DR grade pellets will ensure that here in northern Minnesota, we will have this thing going for at least another 100 years. And this HBI plant in Toledo is the first one. We are going to build more, but I can only build where I have support. We can only do things when everybody pushes in the same direction. The North Shore investment is a critical component to Cleveland Cliffs hot briquetted iron plant, which is currently under construction in Toledo, Ohio. North Shore's DR grade pellets will be feedstock for the HBI plant, a $830 million investment that will be fully operational in mid-2020. 